Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Dead Space 3. That's where we need to go, right? We just killed these creepy freaking toddlers. Man, toddlers are creepy enough in real life without... without... being turned into freaking demon-possessed necromorphs. Look! There's more of them! What hey, is Dana, this? There's this crazy guy that keeps contacting me. I saw him back at the hospital. No one's close. He was a person in the park deck, just like you. Yeah? Well, why was he there? What does he want? He's a psychopath, Isaac. Stay clear of him. He murdered his own wife and child. Okay, I'll be careful. Wait. Looters will be shot on sight. This is not a drill. Where are these stupid toddler children? Where the hell are they? Okay, we need to go that way. I'm gonna check over here. Can we make this chick look like that? No. Come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Nope. Nope, she can't. She wants to be ass up, face down. Credits. Oh, text log. Okay, let's go ahead and have a read. United Spacefaring Guild History Series, Titan Station Conquering a Moon, Part 2 of 2. A large colony was established on Titan... Wait, didn't I already read this? No, maybe not. Okay, a large colony was established on Titan to study the moon's every seismic detail and prepare it for disassembly. As the operation got underway, the orbital platforms that assisted with the work became the prototypes for the planet crackers that would soon follow. Uh, Titan was successfully cracked and harvested, only slightly behind schedule. It was a major boost for then beleaguered population of Earth, who believed their extinction, extinction from lack of resources was imminent. Titan's harvest was halted before the entire moon was disassembled, leaving the small shard where the original colony had started. From here, the station grew in leaps and bounds as a new era of planet cracking got underway, serving as both a critical research outpost and with the advent of shock point drives a way station for all planet cracking missions going forward it is now whimsically known as the sprawl for having done just that over the many years of its operation all right so we got to we got a little history lesson there i probably should have started this out since we didn't play dead space one i just thought of this we probably i probably should have done the previously on dead space um but i did another text log uh, Altman's Footsteps, a publication of the followers of Michael Rittman. We the children of the marker grow tired of the oppressive, thinly vialed attacks from EarthGov on our rights to worship as we please. Reduced hours of operation for the church, fire marshal restrictions on the size of revival events, permits needed to distribute literature, these are all poorly concealed attempts to, qua to quash the truth. Quash? So missing an S, are truth, and they will not succeed. The blasphemous, short-sighted necklace, destructive and hopeless past that EarthGov has us on in is uh, on is a dead end. One that only Unitology has the answer to. Ritman has foreseen it, and we are blessed to execute it. Prepare yourselves, brothers and sisters. Convergence is nigh. Okay. Unitologists are so freaking weird. Alright. I hate these things. I suck at them so much. Oh, there it is. Okay, come on. Come on, where is it? Some of them are harder than others. Um, like the timer ticks down faster. Those are the ones I struggle with for some reason. More! Why so many elevators, Visceral? Dana, I thought you were routing me to residential. This looks like a Unitology recruitment center. Am I still on track? Yes. There's an old maintenance access point in there that'll take you through the waste disposal system and into the Cassini Towers. Stay sharp. Okay, somehow my PC volume got unmuted, like the PC part. Oh my gosh, so many text logs. But somehow my PC got unmuted, so I was like hearing like triple. Um, but the Titan Station Church of Unitality, Recruitment Report, Perry Gibbo, 
vested member tithe status fully paid. Recruiting has slowly market markedly slowed markedly in the last few weeks. This is surely due to EarthGov's recent slander campaign, painting us as carpetbaggers and insurrectionists in the in the press. Regents from the church at Venus Wayport and the Heli Heliopause of uh, uh, I can't even talk observer are shocking and later this week to strategize a response expect additional budget to be allocated to public relations and media to combat this trend also the cec layoffs continue to negatively affect recruiting targets we're down almost 30 percent year on year gabo out credits shit is there one behind me Oh shit! Fuck you, you fucking little shit. Come here. Fuck these stupid children. Where am I hearing them? Holy shit. Die, bitch. Oh my god. Just beat them to death. Beat them to death. Alright. Fuck these little shits. I'm bringing out- I'm bringing out my heavy firepower. Oh, now I gotta- what if I shoot them? Holy shit! Wow, that- Yep, that- that- that's pretty sp okay, well we died! So, I guess we'll figure this out. There wasn't anywhere to shoot, so... I wanted to see what happened if you shot that. I didn't know if you could go out there if it would decompress. It obviously it decompressed. Okay, we already read that on that text log. We don't need to read that again. Okay, time to kill these creepy freaking children. Oh! No, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Okay. Fuck these children! Fuck them! Come on, bitch. Yeah, now that I got an auto gun, you guys are screwed. I'm on point. But I don't have enough ammo for it. Come on, what is this? Seeker. We could try Seeker, I guess. It's not gonna be good against these children. Uh, I guess I missed some plasma cutter under bullets, but that's fine. Convergence is coming, and Unitology will will help it help make it happen. I would not just get out like that. What if there was just a guy like standing right here facing Isaac? You would get. Oh God. Okay, you're dead. I know that now. And you're dead. Right. Okay. Whoever sees this, listen up. You can use kinesis to pull blades off dead ones and shoot it back at them. Watch. Watch. Stay alive three hours using this trick. You see? Just shoot it back at them. I'm gonna bleed out soon. I got clipped pretty bad earlier. So I hope this helps you out. Whoever you are. Oh, so the dude that I picked up and shot, this is him. Right? Yeah, that's him. Come on, come on, Isaac. What is in here? OK, 
Okay, that must be where we go later. You see? Okay. So we got two power nodes. Let me go ahead and start upgrading my pulse rifle. Let's get that capacity up because this is the gun that I want to use. It's the gun I like. We're going to save a power node just in case. There's a power node door somewhere because those usually have good stuff in them. I don't like the sound of whatever's behind me. Whatever is happening outside that door. Let's go ahead and save. Just keep saving. Um, I got these games at GameStop, so I want to be sure that they're not going to glitch out or freeze or whatever, or like all that different stuff. So I want to have a lot of save points. Diagnostic mode initiated for waste compression chamber 752. Compressing piston offline. It is now safe to enter the chamber. Authorized personnel only. Okay, so now it's time to go back and go to through that trash. I missed! Son of a bitch! Reload, 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 Isaac! I don't want- why give me line racks, game? I need bullets for this thing. I need a store. Okay. Entering zero gravity. Let's go over here, looks like some ammo. I can't tell where that- okay, so it wants me to go- how do you- this is hard to control. What is in this door? Hey, power note. Nice. And come on. Yes, there we go. Nope, you didn't drop anything. So I guess that was worth it for the power node. And also the uh, the pulse rounds. It won't open. I am landed. Okay. I don't really get what. Okay. Um. I can't assume the game's gonna let me do this. I'm not sure where I'm trying to get to. Come on! Come on, Isaac! I'm assuming this is it. There looks like there may have been something over there, but... I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright, there we go. You gotta be kidding me, dude. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Oh shit. Oh shit. No! No! Get, the get him off, get him off, guys! Get him off! Take his legs out, take him out, take his legs. Whew. Why must you do this to me, game? Please replace the power unit to use the elevator. 
There we go. Power's back up. See, that's why I saved a power node. Because usually there's another power node within here, or within here, inside of here. Mm, but but right when I say that, there's not one in this one. Oh, this one was pretty ass. Usually they're decent. I'm gonna keep doing that, but um, usually they're pretty good. Usually they're not. That was just kind of. Some of them are pointless, obviously. They can't make them all good, or people. Everybody would just open all of them. There wouldn't be a point not to open them. I need a store that I can actually use, game, not a broken store. So many elevators! And elevators are so creepy. Like that stupid. I never saw it, but that devil movie. Uh, with the people in the elevator and one of them's killing. One's a devil and one's killing them all. Here's a power note, hey? Huh, I wonder if they want you to go back down there and use that power note on that door. Probably. Oh, shit. Little shit. I think when they, they attach to you. Ooh, a text log. Alright, let's go back here in the corner. Okay, maybe that's not a good idea. Text message from Sally Hennon to Marion Hennon. Marion, I'm just going to leave this log here for you to find when you come and get the rest of my stuff. I hope I don't, for I don't forget anything. This is a really big deal. The rebirth is going to happen very, very soon, just like they said. This is a very special time, like once in a lifetime, actually once in a million lifetimes. They say we've been preparing for this since before we were humans. Do you know how special that makes us? We're the ones who get to see it. I'm so excited my skin is tingling. I've got chills. Okay, I've got to go. The ceremonies be the ceremonies begin in a half hour. I don't want to be late. Bye, sis. I love you so much. Come join us. Ha ha K. Bye. Sally. Alright. It's got some credits in here. I'm assuming this no well. I'm trying to tell if she's got boobs. I think so. So there's probably Marion. I wouldn't have, I I think Sally. Shit. Oh, hey, buddy. God. Oh, I hate these stupid little, like, mini necromorphs. No. Oh. Why is everybody dressed the exact same and missing body parts? Okay, nothing in here. Oh god. No, no, creepy room! Creepy children's room! Fuck no! Creepy child's room! Jesus. There's nothing creepier than possessed children. Nothing cheap creepier. Children are creepy to begin with. This one, yeah. Yep, once down this way. I really haven't been using stasis, so I really don't need to worry about having stasis bags. Okay. Dana, Time and soldiers have found me. They're tracking me in some sort of gunship. You're almost here. Hurry! Oh, shit. Am I gonna have to fight some humans up here? This is kind of fun, this is almost- Holy shit! It's been so long since I played this game, I don't even remember most of it, so... It's almost like this is- this is partially blind, I guess, because... Okay, so I'm supposed to go in the elevator. Is there any logs? No. Woo! Alright. Keep going. Oh, 
god, I hate these elevators so much. Alright, let's check the floor quick. So we're supposed to go out that way. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything. Alright, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. In the next one, we will continue trying to find Dana. I think we're on, like, are we on Chapter 4 yet? And we still haven't reached Dana. What chapter? We're not, well, let's go ahead and save. Let's see where we are. We'll get to see. Are we on Chapter 4 yet? I think Chapter 8 or 9. No, we're still Chapter 3. I think Chapter 8 or 9 is the one with the creepy elementary. That I hate that episode so much. I despise it so much. But I will catch you all later. Uh, peace out, guys.